Hey everyone, in this guide we will share instructions on how you can check the battery health of your iPad. Unlike the iPhone that shows you the battery health right inside the settings app, on iPad you have to follow a few extra steps to get this information. This involves enabling iPad analytics data and getting a shortcut that will extract this information for you. So without wasting any time, let's start with the process. The first thing you want to do is open the settings app and tap on privacy and security from the side pane. Here, find and tap on the analytics and improvements option. Then make sure you enable share iPad analytics. If it is already enabled, then you are good to go. If you just turned it on, then wait for one day so that iPad generates a fresh analytics report for you to use. Then tap on analytics data. On the next page, make sure to select the most recently generated file. As you can see here, my iPad already has an analytics report ready for me. However, this is too long and hard to read. Finding out battery health from this file will take hours. Thankfully, you don't have to go through this file. You just need to download a shortcut called battery stats. You can find the link for it in the description of this video. Once you have downloaded the battery stats shortcut and it's added to the shortcuts app, you can use it. Remember, you cannot run it directly from the shortcuts app as you might get the error like me. What you need to do is open the settings app, go to privacy and security, and then tap on analytics and improvements. Here, tap on analytics data, and then tap on the long analytics report from here. Once you're on the analytics report page, tap on the share button from the top and then tap on the more option. Next, select battery stats shortcut from this list. As soon as you do this, the shortcut will run and it will display your device's real battery stats, including its battery health. Here you can see my iPad Air 5's maximum capacity, cycle count, and the battery capacity, which right now sits at just under 92%. That's it. This is how you can find out the battery health of any iPad model. My iPad is running iPadOS 26. So you can see this method works on iPadOS 26 as well as older versions of iOS. Finding out the battery health of an iPad is super useful if you want to get your iPad's battery replaced, buying a used iPad or just want to stay updated with your iPad's current battery health. If you found this video helpful then be sure to hit the like button and subscribe to our channel for more iPad videos. Thanks for watching.